It says here, Dale is buying supplies for a party. She buys X boxes of forks for $5 each. Okay, so there needs to be a 5 and an X because it's $5 for every box of forks and Y boxes of spoons for $6 each. Okay, so we also need a 6 times Y because there are Y boxes of spoons and she buys them for $6 each. Okay, so each of these needs to be in our equation for this to come out right. It also says here that she spent a total of $60. So there's no variable with that total because we're not multiplying that 60 by anything, but that's how much that she spent total. All right, let's go through our answers and see which ones match up with what we have. A, 5x plus 6y equals 60. That looks pretty good. It has a 5x, has a 6y, and it has a total of 60 because these two added together should be the total. That looks great. B, 6x plus 5y. So those got mixed up. It's 5x and 6y, not 6x and 5y. C, 6 plus 5 times x plus y equals 60. So everything got mixed up there. But remember, we need to have these exact coefficients and variables together. That's not going to work. And then D, it does have 5x, right? And it also has the 6y, but everything kind of out of place. 5x, so that's the number of boxes of forks, times 5, plus 60, which is the total, equals the number of spoons, boxes of spoons, times 6. That doesn't really make sense. So everything got mixed up there. Our answer should just be A.